Today on BBN News, we bring you an interview with Dr. Mason, all the latest announcements, and preview the upcoming volleyball season. The BBN News starts now. Good morning, Bull Sharks. I'm Samaya. And I'm Alex. And you're watching BBN, BBN News. News. Seniors, we start off with a few announcements for you. On-campus pictures will be on the 24th from 9.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. There is no sitting fee, however, you must have booked a spot. In addition, there will be a senior parent meeting on the 25th in the Black Box, which will happen at 6.30 p.m. For some quick sports news, the softball team will be having a brief meeting after school today for returning varsity and JV players in the Hope Room. If you are a returning varsity slash JV softball player, make sure to stop by. The meeting should be finished by 2.10. Cross country has started. If you are interested in pace long distance running, practices are on the track after school from 2 to 4 p.m. on Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. The Google Classroom code will be posted below. The BSHS golf season is in full swing. If you are interested in joining the golf team, please see Ms. Phelps in the guidance office or see Ms. Paez in room 1135. And for all my boys basketball players, off-season workouts will begin next week. You must be cleared with a physical. If you have any further questions, please see Coach Razo in room 1153. Let's turn over to Dr. Mason for a quick recap for everything you need to know about athletics. So students have to participate and fill out forms through athleticclearance.com and every student that does sports has to have a physical on file, um, a notarized EL3 form, a copy of their birth certificate, proof of health insurance, and they have to watch three videos that can be found online. They can come ask the athletic office how to do all of this or they certainly can go ask their coach. It's www.athleticclearance.com. So participating in extracurricular activities, including sports and different clubs, really enhances their education and their journey here at the school. Uh, it provides them a new avenue to make new friends, get involved in new things, learn new things. I think that overall when you are involved, it just makes you an overall just better person. In order to stay eligible, all students have to maintain a minimum of a 2.0. Thanks, Dr. Mason. Our athletics have definitely improved over the years, and we hope you get to be a part of the awesomeness. Now let's head over to Lucas for the latest sports news. Thanks, Anchors. On us in Sports Talk, our Bull Shark football team plays tonight against East Lee in our preseason game. Everyone needs to get tickets through GoFan.co online and get our stadium packed. Our boys have come a long way and will not disappoint. Good luck to them and their coaching staff. In other news, our girls volleyball team has their home opener next Wednesday, the 24th, against Marco Island High School. JV will start at 5 o'clock, followed by our varsity at 7. Oh, and did you hear? We have a brand new head volleyball coach this year. I caught up with the old assistant coach, new head coach, Kristen Credelli, to see what she is doing to keep the ball on our court and her opinion about our upcoming season. Take a look. It's pretty exciting um, being a JV coach last year, kind of sitting on the sidelines, taking a step back and seeing, you know, what I can do uh, for the team this year. So I have big things planned and hopefully we have a successful season. Um, well, we do have a lot of great incoming freshmen um, that at their level of play is just outrageous at a freshman level. Uh, so we're going to be pulling up a couple of girls, but I think that we are probably going to be better than last year. <laughs> Love to see uh, the team chemistry really coming together, everyone putting all of their differences aside and coming together as one. Thanks coach. Sounds like there will be a lot of aces going around this year. Go online and purchase your tickets now with GoFan.co. That's right, all sporting event tickets will get through that website. Get them tickets to get into the packed house and cheer on our lady bull sharks. I cannot wait to see how big we can get the student section. If you are new to this, there will be themes for almost every game. So check back with BBN to find out how you can dress out and show your bull shark pride. I know I will be there because it sounds like it is going to be a game you're not going to want to miss. I'll see you guys in court. Back to you, anchors. Thanks, Lucas. That's all the news for today. And remember, bull sharks, just, just keep, keep swimming. swimming.